What's going on YouTubers for ladies and gentlemen? It's the natural born thriller as I rise to reborn the thriller. First off, I want to apologize that I wasn't um, available to watch the show Smackdown and we're tends to doing the live stream, we're tends to doing the watch along for WWE Smackdown, we're tends to night one of the WWE draft. It is unfortunate that I couldn't uh, do that um, for Obvious, re uh, obvious reasons. I'm not going to get to the obvious reasons at, at all. I'm not going to talk about it. Um, it's kind of personal, but um, but I wish I was uh, available, you know, to, uh, to enjoy the show with the rest of the panel. So what I'm decided to do here is to do a, a reaction, not to the show itself, but a reaction to you know to those that were drafted to either Raw or SmackDown, especially when I heard about something. Uh, from NXT call-ups, uh, it's gonna be moving up, which yo, may God, um, yo, have mercy on this soul where we're on um, brands to go to when I raw, but I digress. But that's what I'm gonna do here. So I'm gonna do um reactions to that one to see how that turns out. Not the matches again, not 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 not, not the entire show, just for the ones you know, just basically what tends to the draft, and then night two will continue on on um, that raw, which hopefully I will be available for that one. I just hope so. But if I'm if I'm not, I do apologize for that. Just want to um do that um give you um a, you know a hell of, of of advance you know you know to let you know about you know uh, why you know if you know if I can or not uh, I meant to say, but sorry, just saying on on me I don't know what what's on me it's for for reasons to like it's, it's on me, <laughs> but whatever. But anyways, let's get to it. Okay. The first round of four picks. So the question is, are you ready? Oh my god, will you just get to the... This, I said, are you ready? Just get to the point. This is why I hate watching Blade. He always... And let's get on with the first pick. Here we go. Line. Paul Heyman, Solo Sikoa, and the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns, the Bloodline. No surprises. Wait a minute. So, now that I think about it, three? What about, what about the Usos? Well, either way. Now we know where the World Heavyweight Championship title is going to be um, on now, on Raw, which, you know, no surprise there. No, no shocker, no shocker. All right, who's the, who's the fourth pick? There you go. Speaking of Raw, Raw's first pick tonight. The American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. Really no surprise here if you're running things over on the red brand of Monday Night Raw. Cody Rhodes was exploded on the scene. Barrow stayed on Raw. So he's not going to SmackDown. So, what? What? What does this mean? You gonna have him win the world title as a consolation prize that he could? That, that, that'll be stupid if they do that. By the way. Wait, I thought. The EST of WWE. The Raw Women's Champions, Bianca Belair. Now, listen 
Oh, God. Don't tell me they're going to do the swan the tiles again. I mean, good for Bianca Belair. She's going to be on SmackDown. Her, her new chapter in, in the WWE. Her new journey. Well, no surprise there. Mm. Mm. And that's it for now, until later on. So that's not the main event. Okay. Well, I'm going to go from here now, folks, until we get to the next round of, of draft picks. That's right. I forgot she was on SmackDown before. She's going back to SmackDown because she was SmackDown Women's Champion. Sorry, folks. I, my memory is all real blurry. But there you go. And yeah, pick up Leah's talking right now about being excited going back to SmackDown where she started, actually. You know, it tends to um, being... Yo, ever since coming to me roster. Since when, what, um, 2020? Yeah, it had to be around that time. So, but there you go. Just, just want to, um, to bring that up because I did forget about her being on SmackDown. Now, I want to make the uh, same mistake like the younger Belair, but the Street Profits, they were also on SmackDown before, before they went to Raw. Yeah, actually they were. I remember the whole swatting of the titles between them and New Day. So, yeah. By the way, that was Michael P.S. Hayes and, and that was RVD. So Raw gets Imperium. That means uh, whoever may be the United States champion between Lashley, Bronson Reed, or maybe uh, Austin Theory Stewart is, is the United States champion. One of them will be going to SmackDown. That means that's the end of the of the few of the judgment day. But then again, it was way really over since uh yeah WrestleMania. <laughs> How appropriate that RVD is um saying Matt Riddle because Matt Riddle and RVD has a lot, a lot coming in a way. Mm. 
and that's it for the second round of the four, four people on drop it. So yeah. Or person that um you know that still remains to the show of Raw is Matt Riddle. So Alright. That was it I'll do it for now. Until the next draft picks of uh, you know for round three. Bobby Lashley. <clears throat> but will he be in the current champion coming into SmackDown after Backlash? We'll we shall see. McIntyre's out of SmackDown, not going to Raw. DOC are going <clears throat> will be on SmackDown. I guess there's there's still the OC around. Basically, Miz is not going anywhere. He's still on, on Raw. Going to Raw. He's he's never he's, he's never he, he ain't leaving Raw. But yeah, yeah, they should throw around pick um, throw around. Um, everyone, um, uh, yo. Three out of the four are are going to different brands. Meanwhile, one of them still remains on that brand. And that's all I gotta say from there. I'll see you uh, maybe maybe it's just the fourth round. We'll see. Uh, I don't know, but nevertheless, you'll see me on the next the next draft picks. Here comes the fourth round of the WWE Draft. So we're still doing this whole damage control thing. This time on SmackDown. I don't, I don't agree with that decision. This was my, one of my worries here for Shinsuke Nakamura. All this time he's been on SmackDown. Now, he, now all of a sudden he's, been, he's going to Raw. <sighs> I'm worried. Man, I'm happy for them, but but you told me Kenny Carter and Katana 
But Katana Chance is not going. Maybe, maybe, they, maybe they still will. I don't know. But well, you know what that means. That means we're gonna have a, either a, a tournament for the to crown new NXT Women's Super Champions because they ain't going. They're not going to SmackDown with those belts. But either way, I'm happy for them going to SmackDown. You know, game what's the main roster? Wow. Indy Hartwell is, is 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 going to Raw. Well, that means we're gonna crown new world um NXT Women's Champion too. Where are we gonna do where are we gonna do that one? A tournament whatever? So I mean just just do an NXT um battleground for the rapid drop to Roxanne I mean not Roxanne to Tiffany Stratton. If they if they still wanna do that match. So there you go, folks. That was the fourth round of four draft picks. Two of them were, were shocking. That's why they set it up. So you're telling me, uh, you're telling me that they're gonna lose it. Either way, they're gonna lose it. This is that's the best way they did it. They did it. Whatever. Anyways, but wait, how come any harm was not being interviewed then? Why did why interview the tag of champions? I don't understand. But whatever, moving on. So here's a quick rundown where it tends to the SmackDown um, roster with the, with the WWE draft. You got the NXT Women's Tag Team Champions, Abba Fire and Isla Dawn. You got the OC of Luke Gallows, Carl Anderson, AJ Styles, and Mia Yim or Mia Chin, whichever you want to say. You got Damage Control of Bailey, Eo Sky, and Dakota Kai. You got the Street Profits of Andrew Dawkins and Montez Ford, you got the SmackDown Women's Champ. I mean the Raw Women's Champion. Excuse me, Bianca Belair. You got on um, the Bloodline that only uh, featured three in Paul Heyman, Solo Sokoa, and the WWE Universal Champion or Undisputed WWE Universal Champion Roman Reigns, Bobby Lashley, and Edge. As far as as far as Raw, uh, with the WWE draft, you got um, Louis Kaiser, Giovanni Vinci, and the Intercontinental Champion Gunta, Imperium. You know, do my Samantha Irvin, um, you know, impression. Uh, but the NXT Women's Champion in the Hartwell, the man Becky Lynch, or to me, Big, Big Tom Bex, Drew McIntyre, Matt Riddle, Shinsuke Nakamura. The American Nightmare, Cody Rose, and the Miz. There you go, folks. And from there, I'm going to end it from there. Um, I think that's part of the end of it, because next is, is the main event for the undisputed WWE Tag Team Championships between the Usos versus Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens. And there you go. So that will conclude uh, this re re reaction of you know me reacting to the drafts. Um, you know, 50% of the draft of picks for SmackDown. And the yeah, fifty percent will happen on Raw. Hopefully, I'll do a live reaction for that one. And and if not, then I'll do it on like I did one with this one, like like this, like this, you know, in this type of format. So, uh, but that being said, thank you for watching. For it's the artist. No, no, it's the natural born thriller. Let's not go back to that again. Um, as I say, peace on the streets. All you be well. Stay safe. Take care of yourself. Everything that's going on in the world. 
Until next time, take care of yourselves and each other.